It's Friday, February 16th. I'm Erin Guy with a look at your news to go. Right now, an 18 month old boy is in critical condition after being found unresponsive in a pond. Port St. Lucie police tell us the boy went missing from a home on Southwest Bellevue Avenue Thursday. When officers arrived, they found the boy's father and a neighbor had just pulled the boy from a nearby pond and were performing CPR. Police say no charges are expected. They believe a sibling left a door open. They're calling this a tragic accident. Palm Beach County deputies meanwhile investigating a shooting that left one person dead in Bell Glade. Investigators say it happened at the Glades Food Market on Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard on Thursday. They say friends took the victim to a local fire station. Firefighters gave him aid and rushed him to the hospital where he died. Details about a suspect or a motive have not been released. And starting next week, four more Palm Beach County schools will begin using metal detectors. This impacts students at Dwyer, Boca Raton, Glade Central, and Dr. Joaquin Garcia High School. Eight schools are already using metal detectors. The district hopes to have them all installed at all high schools in the district by the end of April. Weather-wise, let's see what's going on. We're going to see a daytime high today in the upper 70s. Partly cloudy skies, stable, high pressure dominant, but only for one more day. Tomorrow it warms up and steams up, destabilizes out ahead of a front on Sunday. That's your news to go.